Hello guys and welcome to the channel. In this video guys, I'm going to be showing you how to create articles with Canva. Now the Canva app or the Canva website here is a graphic design website here. A lot of people have used Canva in the past to do lots of things, including thumbnail designs, document designs, poster designs. And in this case, we'll be talking about how to create articles with Canva. In the, you know, in the, um, in this era, you have a lot of AI tools which are top in the chat. You have ChatGPT. You have a lot of these apps here that are generating articles. You have even the older apps here, Writer. It's Writer as well, which was like an article generator. Um, and these really worked fine and they still work until now. But we have Canva here, which is a super powerful website here, which they would do more than generate apps it generates you're able to design as well as generate uh, articles so guys this is uh, a good chance guys to start with canva guys and leverage on all these advantages of canva as you can see right here canva is amazing guys canva is amazing i've used canva in the past to put a lot of my thumbnails and also articles using canva and it really works good if you ask me i would say canva is the bomb for a very small fee of ten dollars per month you can do a lot with it all right guys let's not take much time talking about canva let's talk about how to write articles using canva which is why we're here today all right guys so as you know guys um canva is available on uh different levels with different prices and plans and you have the the free, the pro, the teams, and I told you guys, most people here use the free because it's free, obviously. We like free stuff, right? But just know that you can use the Canva Pro for absolutely free as well if you do the right thing. If you watch my video, uh, my video where I describe to you how to sign up for Canva Pro for absolutely free. If you know this, guys, go ahead and watch the video and you can leverage on this and, and go ahead, watch it, and then, um, sign up with canva and use the pro the way i have told you to in that video it's going to work for you and it's still working until date all right guys let's jump into the matter for today which is creating articles using canva all right guys people know canva to be an app, a website for creating um content and in terms of thumbnails and, and you know and graphics but it's more than that guys it's more than that what you do guys is to once you log into canva you can you you go to the home the home tab once you're on the home tab guys you go to where it says docs once you're on docs guys click on docs and it gives you these two options right here doc and docs to deck but look as you can find all the templates here that it gives to you guys we know we don't want to deal with anything below here we're working with the things above here which are docs and docs to deck let's click on doc click right there it says start writing and it gives you a blank page like this. It says begin anywhere, right? Let's begin from where it starts here. Click on the plus button easily. And it gives you an option here, heading, um, subheading, body type, body table, pie chart. It gives you a lot of options right here, which you can use guys. So we're trying to deal with here, magic rights. That is what we're looking for, magic rights. Let's click on, um, magic right here and magic right says okay use five or more words to describe what you want to write okay so what do we really want to write is a big question here now so let's say we want to write an article on let's say blockchain in um the uh, blockchain or bitcoin or you know crypto or whatever you want to write here you could actually describe what you want to write here and it will write it for you so let's go to let's say um, um write me Write me an article on, let's say, uh, blockchain in China. Blockchain use in China. Okay. Blockchain use in China. So, what you do is click on enter button right here and it starts to generate the article. Generous article is that's generate. You can see right here it's loading. It's loading. It keeps loading until the article is ready. So I've counted about 10 seconds now. And here is an article it has generated right here. There you go. It is a short article as you can see right here. And it is really good. 
And perhaps you're wondering what's the quality of this article. What we can simply do is let's copy the article and check for the quality. Let's evaluate this article to see if Canva has given us an article that is, you know, is replicated carelessly or is just it's, a, it's an actually original article. So let's copy this out and um, go to another website. Copy this out and go to uh, let's say uh, let's look for plagiarism checker. Plagiarism checker. Let's go to this one here, which is a free tool. I believe it's a free tool. Let's go here and let's check how how original the article is. Let's do try now. No, let's go back. I think I, I pressed the wrong the wrong button. Let's go back here. And this the article right here is pasted. Let's go to start now or say it says here check plagiarism. Let's go to I'm not a robot. And then we select this puzzle here. It says boats. These are all boats. Uh this is a boat as well. Uh, let's go to OK, verify. And we're good. Let's go to check plagiarism. Okay, and you can see it's scanning the article. Let's see the quality of the article produced by the Canva article writer. What is called the magic, the magic writer. It's loading. As you can see right here, it's loading. Guys, this is a very good chance for you to leverage on the uh, advantages or sort of the, um, the perks of Canva. Now let's go here. Now let's go here. Have a look at this. It says here, zero percent plagiarism, one hundred percent unique, guys. Guys, this is amazing, guys. Canva is able to graphically design stuff for you, or design stuff in, you know, with good graphics as well as write articles for you. This is amazing, guys. What are you waiting for, guys? Canva is the way to go. All right, guys. Perhaps you're thinking this article is too short. I want another article. So what I'll say to you guys is to simply go to Canva if you're using Canva. Go to Canva. But what you can do is is create subhead subheadings for um, your article and go to Canva and plug in the subheadings so Canva can help you generate um, generate the the article. For example, let's say you you're broken you've broken down your article into into um say the introduction introduction which is like uh what is the blockchain right blockchain what is block uh chain you can see you can see the two next one is um 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 what is the uh what are you can see what are the advantages of using blockchain see what are the users of of blockchain you can just go ahead guys and create subheadings guys that that magic writer of, of canva can use to generate your article for you just so you can have a lengthy article right but it's because this article is really short and it may not really yeah, catch all the details that you wanted to so what you can do is to help canva magic writer to 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 capture these subheadings or capture these areas or scopes through giving accurate and descript well descriptive and, and specific um subheadings and once that's done guys guys um you see that the magic writer will give you exactly what you're looking for that's how to use the magic writer guys so i was helpful guys go ahead guys try this out and let me know exactly how you feel about it i know that now we have a lot of competition there's uh chat gbt there is there's so many of them in the market right now of this um uh, of these uh, writers in the market but guys let's know how this compares i'll say to you if you're paying for canva pro for example or you have canva pro there's nothing wrong with having everything in one in one station so if you have canva pro or canva for example and you're able to use this you're able to have your graphical design your graphic design in one graphic design in one place as well as your writing too and you know and that is a lot, that makes a lot of sense for someone like me who doesn't want to go to like 
A, B, C places and get, um, have random stuff, you know, for my, my, my work. All right, guys, I hope it was helpful. Please leave a like, subscribe to the channel, guys. Let me know exactly what I should create next time. Maybe an interest you have or any questions at all I can help with. Please comment in the comment section and let me know. All right, guys, thank you for watching and bye for now.